operate override and bypass of safeguards only with authorization. A safeguard, mechanical or instrumented, is a system that protects process equipment from exceeding specific set points. Inhibit override is defined as an imposed interruption of the normal operation of an instrumental or mechanical safeguard. Scope and risks When a safety system is bypassed or inhibited, the safety measures in place are insufficient. This process safety fundamental applies mainly during Maintenance turnaround Inspection, test or calibration of equipment and instruments Commissioning and startup phases Testing of interlocks Malfunctions of a primary element Operating instructions Understand the function and criticality of the system to be bypassed or inhibited. When a protection system is unavailable, perform a risk assessment and define alternative or mitigative protection measures to temporarily compensate for the missing system. Remember that any exclusion or bypass of protection systems shall be done in agreement with company procedures and requires formal authorization. The level of authorization shall be in line with its criticality. Record and keep each bypass override in a dedicated logbook available in the control room, which must always be kept updated. Discuss and reauthorize active bypasses and overrides at each shift change. Protect the safety interlocks from easy exclusion in field and in control room. Limit the time extension of bypasses and overrides, avoiding extensions beyond the allowed time. Longer periods require an adequate change management process. Always consider the cumulative risk of multiple safeguards inhibited at the same time. Reminder This video illustrates basic rules to be observed during daily activities, company procedures, operating instructions and work permits govern the execution of each intervention. Not complying with them could cause damage to people, the environment, assets and have a possible impact on the company's image and reputation.